Who's that? The opera singer. Singer? She's the most famous performer in all of Europe. She sold out La Scala a dozen times. Not to mention the French opera. Huh. What are you doing? Following you so you can introduce me to Miss Lynn. But introduce you? Yeah. I don't know her. Everybody knows. You just said so yourself. Yeah, exactly. You don't just march up to someone like this. Oh, we're a person. Oh, she's a person. Well, yeah. <clears throat> <clears throat> Miss Lynn. My name is Philip Carla. And this extraordinary gentleman next to me. Phineas Taylor Barnum. The pleasure's mine. Cool. Just you are the American. I believe I might have heard of you. Oh, well, if you've heard of me all the way over here, I must be doing something right. That or something very wrong. Well, well in the world of publicity, there's hardly a difference. I believe those are the words of a scoundrel, Mr. Barnum. A showman, Miss Lynn, just a showman, the best on my side of the Atlantic. Well, if you do say so yourself. I do, but I don't have to. Oh, no, no, right? no, no, he is one of the best. Well, that's very kind of you. Miss Lynn, let me get to the point. I'd like to bring you to New York. And if you agree, I'll make you the most famous singer, not in Europe, but in the entire world. Hmm. And have you heard me sing? Absolutely. Oh. No, I haven't. Uh, but like mine, your reputation precedes you, and well, I trust your reputation more than my own taste, so. I've never been to America. You will sing in the grandest theater with the finest orchestra in the greatest city on earth. Jenny Lind. One night only. Or maybe two. <laughs> and at 20% of the gate, it'll be a Queen's ransom for your efforts. I give most of my earnings to charity, Mr. Barnum, to orphans and widows. Voice of a nightingale, heart of an angel. That's brilliant. I mean, the press will go crazy for that story. That's not a story. May I ask you something, Mr. Barnum? Anything? Why me? People come to my show for the pleasure of being hoodwinked. Just once I'd love to give them something real. Miss Lynn. 